everyone i'm back with another video and yes my voice does sound off it's because um i currently have a cold but um i'm slowly you know taking medication to heal i just finished some of my tea right here as you can see it's empty it was gins ginseng with honey but um anyways today i'm going to be doing um kind of a full face of dollar tree makeup um, I guess I will say this is more, I will, I will title it, uh, me doing a full face of affordable makeup, but, um, I did get a lot of these items from Dollar Tree, and I showed you guys what I got in my previous haul, but, um, I have already moisturized, well, I have already put my primer on, and I just used some of my Wet n Wild primer that I got from CVS not too long ago, and, um, this primer smells really good. I would have used my Pond's um, face moisturizer, but uh, I feel like that wouldn't really mix well with the makeup that I have that I'm going to be putting on my face. And then I just finished filling in my eyebrows with my e.l.f. Um, brow pomade, and this is in the shade Espresso, and I really love this product a lot. I just got it from Amazon, so... um. What I'm gonna do is I haven't concealed underneath my eyebrows yet because I'm going to be using my new product. So uh, let me show you guys. I'm gonna be using this product to conceal underneath my eyebrows and like underneath my um, eyes. So yes, um, and this is called, well, it's from the brand Be Pure, and this is the Hydrating Tinted Moisturizer, and this could work as a light foundation and act as a moisturizing, as a hydrating moisturizer. So I, I already know that this isn't my exact shade. I had two options, but um, I got this one because... Um, I also wanted to do like a little highlight underneath my eyebrows, so that's why I got this one. So it feels good quality. Here it is right here. Clearly it is lighter than my complexion, so I'm just going to apply some underneath my... So I'm just going to be applying some underneath my eyebrows. So here I go. Let me. This is the first product I'm using for the day, and this is how it will come out. And I'm using this little brush to apply it underneath my brows. So I'm gonna kind of try to do a neutral look today because I do have to go to work later. So here I go. I'm just going to apply it just like normal. Oh, yeah, she bright. But this might work as a great um, concealer, highlighter underneath my brows. I already see. So that's how it's looking. And I'm going to take this beauty blender and... So this is given like highlighter to me. I could use this definitely as like a highlighter. So yeah, this item right here is from Dollar Tree. My stomach. I went a little too heavy on my brows today, but it's okay. I'm going to take my finger and okay so this is how oh god on camera it looks much brighter but in person it doesn't look as bright I promise you well I probably gotta do a little more blending but um this is how it's looking right now I probably have to turn down my all right, I'll just leave it there. 
so um this is how this product is looking on my skin right now it's like i almost forgot how to do my makeup so what well, i'm very excited to use i'm gonna be trying the winter um makeup palette that i got from dollar tree and um this is the color story on the back it looks very pretty like very very pretty so I just cleaned all my makeup brushes. I don't think this has a mirror. Oh, it does have a mirror. Okay, let me take this down. So this palette is very beautiful if you guys can. Pick this up while you can. Uh-oh, the light is blinding. But this is from Dollar Tree. From Dollar Tree. I mean, I was kind of surprised, but am I really? Because Dollar Tree has been stepping their um, makeup game up. So let's see. I'm going to start with um uh, are those highlighters down there i think i'm gonna take a little bit of code right there and i'm just i'm not gonna use any other palette just this palette you know i probably should have put a primer on but it's okay so i'm just going to um do what i usually do uh, apply I'm gonna be very generous with this hopefully it shows up so I just applied some like up here in this area all right <laughs> I think it's looking quite decent like the show up so just doing the same thing you know I'm not mad at this palette. Like, what? <laughs> so I'm doing the same thing again. I love when I'm at work and I see other, like, women wearing makeup. I'm just like, y'all are so talented. Like, I love the creative looks, too. So I'm not going to go too crazy with the transition shade. So now I'm going to take, um, let's see. some of nippy this brush isn't from dollar tree i will say that i was trying to save even though i was at dollar tree i was trying to save some coins still and i'm only going to be applying nippy like right in this section right here kind of taking it up because I want to uh, add another shade. So I'm going to do the same to this side. This palette, I'm not mad at it. And um, the thing about this brand is that they come in all four seasons. So I got winter because, you know, we're in winter now. Well, we're headed into winter, so I'm going to go back to this side and okay. So now I see this very cute shade right here called Sleet and um, I'm going to add that to the second half. Uh, the part that I didn't fill in. She's cute. She's cute. <laughs> I think it's coming out really well. I know there's a whole range of colors to choose from this palette, but just for today, I'm just going to be using those colors. So uh, now I'm going to be moving on to 
the eyeliner that I got from Dollar Tree and this is the LA Colors Auto Eyeliner and this is a, it's a smooth application smudge proof cruelty free yes I just realized that it said cr cruelty free LA Colors yes this is why I um love that's the thing about me and makeup I want all my makeup to be cruelty free because I just mm -mm, I just can't do it with the animal abuse so because I was running low on eyeliner so here it is right here you know just a basic black eyeliner this is the one that you oh it's got a nice tip to it okay was not expecting that let me show you guys I'm going to, I don't know, I'm, I think I'm going to do a little dramatic today, not really. Can you guys see? My lashes are so curly. All right, let's see. So it's coming out, the texture is like a crayon. <laughs> it's like a crayon. um um so with the eyeliner you can't really it might be my eyeshadow or maybe i'm not pressing hard enough So I may have to go over it with one of my actual eyeliners, but um, this is how it comes off right there. Uh, I will try this without the eyeliner later, but um, I just love a good dark eyeliner. So I'm just going to go over it, go over it with my Wet, Wet and Wild. This is also affordable um, eyeliner, so I'll count it. I guess it counts. So I'm just gonna kind of go over it then. Okay, and now, of course, to my other side. I feel like I could have done better with my eyeliner, but it's okay. <clears throat> so I didn't purchase mascara from there, but I did get this from Marshalls, so it's affordable. I'll be um, just putting, this is my only current mascara that I have right now. I should have definitely picked up more mascara, but it's okay. Okay, so I have put on my mascara and I'm honestly, I guess I'll use this as a, oh yeah, I was supposed to put some underneath my eyes. So let me do that. Oh shoot. Yeah, clearly. <laughs> but it should, you know, this should definitely give my under eye some um illumination i'm gonna kind of let it let that sit for a little bit underneath my eyes what time is it i'm on i'm recording on my phone oh my god and um since i'm wearing a mask and you know people will only see uh the top half of my eyes i'm not gonna put any foundation on because the foundation will just get on my mask 
So I'm not going to put any foundation on right now. Uh, let me let this sit a little bit more. But I'm going to show you guys my lip options that I have. So um, I got this lip gloss right here. I have this, uh, I think this is a matte lipstick right here. And then I have this one right here. But since we're doing kind of like holiday, I want to put this one on today. So let me go ahead and... Oh, shoot. <laughs> Probably isn't the best to use my finger, but... The texture of this is nice, though. I will say this product has a nice texture. And the quality is quite nice, too. I think... Oh, it's looking... Yeah, I'm gonna have to set that. <laughs> to set that. So I'm using my AOA... No, do I use this one? All right, I'm gonna just use this one today. Ooh, I almost spilled that. And I'm taking this um, brush right here. Oh, that's so much. Dang. You guys, so much came out. Like, I was not expecting that. I was not expecting that. Holy moly. Just go underneath. Wow. <laughs> okay. ouch oh and please be careful when doing that those bristles are hard so now i'm going to be using this um lip gloss and it goes well with my nails so uh, i have already moisturized my lips to prep for this Oh, this is pretty. Look at it. Yes, my hands are ashy. Sorry, guys. This one doesn't have a... Oh, it says cheerful on it. Ooh. So here's how it comes out. These smell so good. Like, I can't. So let's see. Oh, all right. Okay, she's coming on. That's all I needed, <laughs> really. So this is the product by itself without any uh, lipstick or anything. But I think what I'm going to do is that I'm going to put I'm going to try this product out for the sake of the video and I'm going to add some of that lip gloss on top. Here it is. And I don't know how this works. Oh, oh. This is such a different application. I don't know what to do with this, but here I go. I guess I just squeeze it. Mm-hmm. All right. So, she just read. I do not like the smell of this. So it just has a little um, brush. And now what I'm going to do is that I'm going to put a little bit of this over it. So 
so so you guys this completes the look and the next time i use this palette i'm gonna switch it up but um today since i'm going to work i i didn't really want to like you know have makeup that was like bold bold but, um i hope everyone stays safe happy holidays and um i really want to thank you guys for um you know watching my videos and just supporting me even if you guys are silent watchers um i definitely will find a way to get back to you guys um i know there's a lot of ways it's just i'm trying to figure out what will be the best way to give back to you guys but I hope everyone stays safe and I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.